YouTube, Mozzie back with another video, man. Another video for you guys. I really appreciate everybody that's been watching my video. Everybody that's subscribed, man. I'm blessed to have each and every last one of y'all to come to my channel, man. If you haven't subscribed already, make sure you subscribe to one of the fastest growing car channels on YouTube, man. If you like the video, make sure you hit the like button. Comment down below. If you want to talk to me or reach me in any kind of way, ask me anything, man. Hit me up on my social media. That is the fastest way to hit me. Uh, I have my Instagram and my Snapchat in the description below. But I had to share out this truck, man. So I've been saying I was gonna get a truck to add to the channel. I've been saying that for the longest, and I think I might have found the one that I want. Now, still trying to decide on which one I actually want. This is, I like the color, but it's not the color that I want to get it in. Of course, <laughs> y'all should already know what color I need to get it in. But this truck is amazing, man, from top to bottom. I love it. Uh, it will be when I get the truck it will have to be customized just for me because a lot of options in the truck that I want to have Added to it. That's not already on here, but as far as the truck overall, I really like the truck So I'm gonna let y'all see the truck man. Y'all can tell me what you think. So this is the Ram 2500 of course it is man it, it, You already know y'all should have known man. Of course it has to be twin turbo because I do need the speed this is a Laramie. So the Laramies, I like the Laramies. Now the other ones that they have are like the um, the Long Stars and stuff like that. But the Laramies, I love the look of the Laramie. Like you can see, like this front, this front is insane, bro. And then I like the little how they have like the little these little. I mean, they're not functional, but if you look at from over here, like they look, it looks nice, nice little look for the hood. But I would probably actually get the functional that hood scoops to actually go in there. So I have to get that custom made and done. You can see how aggressive like the headlights look. Like I like that. Like they look like they just have to, they just got a lot going on right there. So like I said, this is a twin turbo diesel. So you can see how big the suspension system is. All that when I get my truck and I start to get it like done and modded, of course all of it get changed out. The big tires, all of it get changed out. Uh, I do want to get a running board. This does not have a running board, but I want to get the one where when you open the door, it automatically comes out. So I would get one of those when I get my truck, of course. Of course, four by four. When I get my check, gotta be four by four. I'm be towing my Hellcat, so it has to be. You can see right here, it has the camera right there. Like, okay, water bottle. Well, a lot of space back here, man. A lot of space. Be putting my tires and all that kind of good stuff in the back from when I take it to the track. Of course, you got the tow hook right. There. So, and this, but this color wave, this octane red, bro. This is <laughs> this color wave is insane. Now I love the octane red, but. For me, of course, I would have to get my truck silver. I have to, you know, it's only right. <laughs> it's only right. And you can see right there at the top, they got the snow lights at the top of it. I like that. I might keep those on my truck. I might. I'm not sure yet. But then I got the, the side mirrors with the tow, with the trailer mirrors on there. Let's get on the inside this big thing. So as you can see, it pretty much, it's it's pretty spacious. It got, it got some room, so. It definitely got some room. And then they got like little compartments right here that can be like for coolers or whatever. This is for the actually go on the for the tow hook. But they have like little compartments right here. And they have that on both sides, which you know, of course, y'all already know we're gonna get back here and test it out. But they have, you know, you can lift the seats up. Of course, you need more room, you can always lift the seats up. And then when you lift the seat up, if you need more room, you can always turn this into like a little I don't know what you want to call it like a mini bed or whatever you want to call it it turn into something I don't know you might have something you need to put back down here oh this still got the little cup holders oh okay so if you want to get a little <laughs> you know if you're into you know a little something extra and you want to be a little different and you want to you know have your woman and we ain't gonna talk about all that man y'all get the <laughs> y'all get the point man so you can always have like some right here. You may need some more room. Put it, you know, I can always put my some put more tires back here. So I actually like this truck. I like the compartments that I have back here, but we finna sit back here and see what it's like as far as oh yeah, I forgot about that. We lift that up, they have another compartment down there too. Let's close this. Alright, let's not break that. Cause we we not buying this one. So let's get back here and see what the room is looking like. So, so we in here, we in the back. So of course you can probably more likely you can fit somebody in the middle. But if we on the side, we got pretty good room. You know the seat. Oh, so they got they got room up there as you can see. They got some pretty decent room up there. 
But you know, we we pretty rooms back here. We got some room back here. So, you know, head's not touching the ceiling. I got some pretty good leg room. You know, I'm comfortable. I can I can relax back here. So this is this is good. I like this. Of course, you got the gas, which is obviously two of these only. You should know that by now. But you also have to fill this up too. This also has to go in there. So this is like the uh, the death blue. It's some more fuel that has to go in there as far as like the gas, while all that kind of good stuff. And it show you right there how much you need. You know when when it runs out and all that good stuff too. So that also has to go in there with the gas. But you know you have the stuff right here for the towing, heated seats, vented seats. And it is four by four, so you can change it from a two-wheel drive to a four-wheel drive. So, which is, yeah, I like this. I like this. And of course, you have a plug, man. You may be, you know, hungry, you know. <laughs> Put your microwave in here, man, and go on about your business. So, we got the two glove compartments, you know, for my safety only compartment. I had a 1500 at first, but I would definitely get a 2500 now or a 3500. A 3500, of course, those are the doobies, but. I'm mean, thinking about getting a 3500 too. That's why I say I'm, I'm still looking, but this 2500 man is definitely starting to grow on me. So y'all can comment down below and let me know what y'all think about, you know, which one I should actually get. But I'm definitely starting to like this, this 2500 a lot. You know, of course there will be a lot of stuff that I would, I would change. Like I would get and mine's, they have a 12 inch screen option option <laughs> option that you can get. Of course I would have to get that one. I definitely gotta get the 12 inch screen. I can't go without that now. So I would definitely get that. Uh, of course, obviously, I would most definitely have to get the sunroof put in mind. That's a must. I cannot go without a sunroof again. So, I would definitely have to get that. Like I said, I do, of course, I like the Octane Red. That Octane Red is like insane. But for me, I would have to go with Superman the Master Car, you know. So, of course, I would do the whole lift kit, big tires. Uh, more than likely, I would end up putting like some kind of crazy design on the side of it. I wouldn't do the Dallas Skyline. I would do something else crazily. Some, some crazy. I don't know what I'd do to it, but it would do, I would do something crazy to the outside of it. But the 2500 is definitely what I'm starting to lean towards more. Um, but y'all can comment down below. Let me know what you think of the truck. Let me know what truck y'all think I should get. Because I definitely want to start inviting trucks into the channel. So let me know what truck you think I should get. Now, the Ford I like, but I mean, come on, man. That's a ram. I mean, who can go wrong with that? But let me know what you think. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about the truck. So you know how in every last one of my videos, man, whoever told you the sky's the limit lied to you because we know absolutely no limit, man. So let's get this money.